Is the Tarawih prayer a Sunnah or is it a Fad? Can a person miss it? Alhamdulillah. Wa salatu wa salam. Ali Rasulillah wa ala alihi wa sahbihi ajma'in. Amma ba'd. A'udhu billahi min ash-shaytani r-rajim. Bismillahi r-Rahman r-Rahim. Rabbi shahli sadri wa yassalli amri. Wa halu al-ugdata min lisani yafqaf qawri. As far as the question is concerned that is Tarawih or is Qiyamul Layl during Ramadan, is it Fard or is it a Sunnah? As we discussed earlier, a beloved Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, it's mentioned in Sayyid Bukhari, or number three, in the book of Tarawih, Hadith number 2012, and it gives how Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam offered in the mosque Qiyamul Layl during Ramadan, and people joined him. The next day the news spread and when he came the next day the full mosque was filled. The third day it was overflowing and fourth day purposely though the mosque was overflowing he did not come out for Qiyamul Layl for the Tarawih which people call. And when he came for the Fajr Salah I said not that he did not know that people were waiting for me but I purposely didn't come because I didn't want offering the Qiyamul Layl in Ramadan is a fard. So from this hadith we come to know that it is not a fard. But the other hadith of Sahih Bukhari, volume number three, the book of Tarawih, hadith number 2009, the beloved Prophet said, that anyone who offers the night prayer in Ramadan with the belief and seeking Allah's reward, all his past sins will be forgiven. So based on this we come to know, Though it's not a fard, it's a very important sunnah. It's sunnat al-mawqadah. That means a very highly recommended sunnah of the Prophet. Though it's not a fard, it's sunnat al-mawqadah. Very highly recommended sunnah. And no Muslim should miss it unless he really has a valid reason. He should as far as possible offer it and seek Allah's reward. So all his sins will be forgiven.